Hello, I just got home after a day of wearing my new to Toto Bobo uh, mask. Um, I've been wearing it on and off for nine and a half hours. Um, off to, of course, drink coffee, eat lunch, um, and drink water. Um, and it is a little challenging to talk in, I would definitely say, because you can't get a whole lot of movement without breaking the seal. So that is probably the most awkward thing about it. Um, and you can probably see there's some a good amount of condensation. Um, it is a tiny bit fiddly getting the right fit, obviously. So I worked on it last night um, to, I did a little bit of trimming. Um, I trimmed the chin area, I trimmed a little bit off the nose area because even the small is pretty big on my teeny tiny face, which believe it or not is very small. Um, and did a little bit of heat manipulation um, to widen the chin area and tighten up the nose area. And I do need to tighten up a little bit more. I've noticed a little bit of gappage up here and a little bit of air on my exhalations going up into my eyes. So if I were wearing glasses, they would probably be fogging up, but that is something that can definitely be done. It is totally adjustable. Um, it just takes a little bit of work up front to get that um, where you want it to be. So we can see I mean, there's some lines. I always have lines. I have crazy sensitive skin, so when I touch it or rub it with my fingers, it usually gets really red. Tiny bit of irritation just from the um, the cordage, which is very, very soft and very stretchy and barely necessary. It basically, because it forms a pretty good steel, it, well, when I talk, of course, it doesn't stay very on very well, but it mostly um, stays on by itself. Um, so the ear straps are um, there's not a whole lot of pressure on those, but it did still irritate my ear a little bit just because anything touching my ear irritates my ear. Yes, I know, Nico. And <laughs> left um, a little bit of marks, but n nowhere near as much marks as, um, as an actual respirator, which, holy crap, always leave me bruised if I wear them for more than a couple of hours across the nose. So... I think right now it's still a win. I'm going to uh, take out the filters and give it a good wash with soap and water because I can. Um, rubbing it down with alcohol. I used an alcohol wipe during my lunch break because I took it off for a while then. Um, that really helped. I got a really good seal after wiping it down with the alcohol wipe. Shocker. Not surprising at all. Okay, I'm going to go feed my cats. Bye.